Hello everyone, I'm Jericho, I'm 25 years old and I'm a graduate software engineer. I'm here today to tell you about my journey with IT Career Switch. So my background was originally in healthcare. I did biology and chemistry for my A-levels, I went to uni, did an undergraduate degree in biosciences and after that I worked several jobs in the healthcare sector as a domiciliary carer and as a healthcare assistant. It was around this time when the popularity of hybrid working and remote working jobs was skyrocketing. And I was also contemplating whether or not to go back to uni and do medicine. So at this crossroads in my life, I had a decision to make. And I decided that I wanted to go into web development and I enrolled myself onto the coding traineeship in October of 2021. I always had an interest in technology and computers but it never really occurred to me that I could one day have a career in tech because I never did computer sciences at uni. At the time, I wasn't going anywhere with my job either and going back to university to do more studying wasn't an option at that stage. So that's when I decided to make the switch. I decided to go with web development and learn how to code because it's an in-demand skill and it's got good career progression. I came across IT Career Switch in one of my many Google searches. I decided to go with them because they had glowing reviews and the best value for money that I could find. Some of my favourite things about the course were the flexibility that they gave you. In my case, I was able to fit my studies and manage my schedule around my full-time job. As a person who likes to problem solve, I also fell in love with the process of building web apps. They teach you full stack coding languages like C Sharp and React, which are highly sought after in today's job market. I also really appreciated the help they provided during the recruitment process. They helped me draft up my CV and build an online presence. After the coding traineeship, I was able to land a job with the Access Group. They're a fast growing UK based software company that provides business solutions across many sectors, including education, non-profit, and healthcare. Some of their products include HR solutions, finance, and other specialized software for specific industries. So this is what a typical day looks like for me. Being from Warsaw, I do have to drive quite far to get to Loughborough, which is where my office is based. But luckily, my company allows me to work hybrid and I can choose to work from home when it suits my calendar. Although I have to travel far to get to the office, ironically, it's one of my favorite things about the place. The fact that it's away from the city, it's quiet, and there's not much traffic coming in and out. It makes it a very peaceful place to get work done. The first thing I like to do is check through my emails and have a look through my calendar just to set the agenda for what I have to do that day. My first few months involved a lot of in-person workshops and hands-on sessions to get us new starters up to speed with the company's engineering processes. On some days, I have a lot of meetings to attend. On others, I have some free time to do some self-directed learning. My most recent assignment with my team was to reimagine and add features to a widget that exists on the company portal. The technologies I use from day to day are JavaScript and React for the front end and CSharp.net for the back end. For this, amongst other things, IT Career Switch has done well to prepare me for the demands of my new job by giving me prior experience with said languages and frameworks. Let me explain to you what the team dynamic looks like in a big software company. Access takes an agile approach to software development, which in essence means we operate in sprints lasting two to four weeks with the aim of delivering bug fixes, features or optimizations by sprints end. The journey starts with the team selecting which tasks to prioritize and engage in. Throughout the sprint, 
the team has daily meetings to share progress, stay aligned, and discuss blockers. Once the sprint concludes, the team showcases the completed work in a review, which is then followed by a retrospective, where we can discuss what went well and what didn't. As a software engineer, I love having the freedom to manage myself. It gives me a sense of pride and ownership over my responsibilities. It has enhanced the quality of my work and motivates me to keep learning. So that wraps it up for a day in my life. Thank you all for watching.